Hey, it's Stephen Wright with Jackson Kayak, and today I'm going to show you how to install these brand new Bees Knees thigh hook system for your Jackson Kayak. These can be put in any whitewater boat that we have ever made and that you might own. In order to install these things, you're going to need the accessory kit itself, which is the Bees Knees thigh hook system. You're going to need a Phillips head screwdriver or some other kind of sharp, thin metal poking device and you will likely want to have either a hair dryer or a heat gun and that's it let's get to it before we install the new thigh pads we need to remove the old one and the first step is to pop out these existing little plastic rivets that hold the old pad in place to this plastic thigh platform i use a screwdriver or something else kind of sharp and metal and then just try to push them through from the top down and what you're going to find is the little part's going to pop right out and then you can peel the top one away. The kit comes with, with two brand new ones for each side so you don't have to worry about keeping them. And then just force them through and you are done with this step. The second step is we actually have to peel away the existing thigh pad. Now depending on how old these things are and how well attached they are, this may be easy or it may be a royal pain. If it feels like they are tearing apart into little bits, you may want to take your hair dryer or heat gun and start heating it as you go, being careful not to overheat the boat behind it. That will cause the adhesive to let go and it'll peel away a little bit more easily. Now I'm just going to wipe down this area where the pad used to be to get all the dirt and residue off of there. I'm using uh, an old t-shirt rag with rubbing alcohol, but you can just use soap and water, whatever you've got. You want to make sure you don't leave any residue of anything you're cleaning with. So just go ahead and get all the dirt if it's an older boat um, and as much of the sort of bits of leftover foam and thigh pad off of there as possible before we go to install the new one. Now it's time to install the new thigh pad for my Bees Knees thigh hook system. Step one is I'm going to remove the thigh hook part in order to make this more flexible. The next thing I'm going to do is carefully remove the adhesive backing so that the adhesive is exposed. Now at this point I want to be very careful not to touch this because if I have to touch it and pull it away from something it's going to make it not as sticky when I put it in place. What I'm going to do next is actually heat up this adhesive using a hair dryer or carefully using a heat gun. That's going to make the pad a little more malleable and flexible. It's also going to make the adhesive stick a little better. I'm using a heat gun and so I'm just going to slowly and carefully go over the back of this thigh hook. All right, now my thigh pad is ready to install. I need to be very careful when I put this in to not stick it to any part of the boat anywhere I don't want it to be. So what I'm going to do is bend this aggressively in this direction so that the part that's going up against this thigh platform is the only thing touching anything. I'm holding the rest out of way here. I'm going to stick this in place. You can have a tiny bit of overlap here, but not much. And then I'm going to squeeze it from the inside and I'm going to start rolling it and squeezing it up into place with my fingers inside here so that it is connecting all the way up into this knee area. You can see I'm holding this end up in a way as I force this thing up into the tightest part of the knee pocket and roll it down into place one bit at a time. Because what I don't want is for this to bridge this gap. And so once it's pushed in place firmly, I'm going to seat it by really pushing it into here all over the place. The more pressure I get, the more strongly it's going to stick. The final step is that I need to install these little plastic holding rivets. 
what those things do is help prevent this from peeling down away from the um, plastic thigh hook platform. For this, you could use a drill with a small bit, maybe an eighth or a quarter inch, or you can take anything sort of sharp and thin. This is my multi-tool. And I want to be careful to hold this up in place as I try to poke through it because I don't want to push and peel the new thigh pad away from the plastic thigh platform, thigh hook platform. So I'm just going to push this into place, wiggle it around a little bit. I have now poked a hole in there. And then all I need to do is uh, I'm going to put the top half of this plastic rivet here, which is the bigger opening end. The bottom part looks like this. This goes underneath, sticks up into place, pops in there. Do one of these on each. Let's see, where's the little, there it is, hole. You're gonna see it sort of pop into place and that side is done. All I need to do next is repeat the same thing on the other side and I'm ready to get in the boat and put the pads in place. All right, you've got your new thigh pads installed with the Velcro backing. So now all you're gonna do is take the thigh hook part. You're gonna adjust your outfitting so that you are with your back band and your bulkhead sitting the way you normally sit in the boat without these so that you are in the right spot front to back for the way you normally paddle. Then all you're going to need to do to get these things in place is pop a knee into the middle. I'm going to put these down lined up vaguely with the middle of the thigh pad. I'm going to hold this in place on the inside of my knee and I'm going to place the inside of it up and against this um, plastic thigh platform. I'm then going to hold the underside of the thigh hook here and simply roll it up into place with my leg. If I got it wrong, all I need to do is peel it away and start over. Once it's in place, I'm gonna check and try to make sure that it's actually touching a lot of the Velcro area so that it sticks really, really well, and I am ready to rock. The only thing you wanna keep in mind this can cover your leg comfortably in a wide range of places. You wanna pick a spot, aim for a placement so that it touches a lot of Velcro, but you do not wanna let this thing hang out past this plastic thigh platform because if I do this, it might look cool and it might feel okay when I'm paddling, but every time I get in and out of the boat, my leg is going to catch on it and peel it away. Soon it's not going to stick very well and it's going to be very annoying. So make sure when I put this thing in place that it's pretty flush up against here and doesn't overhang too much. Once I do this on both sides, I am ready to rock and your Jackson kayaks are going to fit your knees more securely than you have ever felt before. You are going to love it. I'll see you on the river.